everyone, I'm coming back on to do this video today of um, card sketch challenge that I was doing last year um, and I've done the template as you can see um, and just put the info at the side I made this myself on uh, my computer like I did last year and um, yeah, I'm coming on today because I've I was starting to uh, make it off camera and I was going to show it, but then I thought, well, no, I want to come on and just have a little chit chat and show you the rest how I make it. Um, I've started off with a basic kind of uh, template, but I'm thinking in the next couple of weeks I want to make some getting a bit hard not hard a bit like challenge myself and whoever if, like wants to join in how I did last year with a few of the ladies um yeah just to get into making more cards again because uh, I want them to be able to send out like I've got them ready what I've made or when I've got birthdays and things or a thank you card and I just love how uh, when I take part doing this um, it just gives me different ideas and gets me motivated with making cards and that again um, so yeah so this is the template it's a six by six card but I'm thinking of doing um, like a square easel card I've been making them a lot at the minute so I'm just going to use that as my template as the base for a minute and then I'll put fit it all on after and I've got some, um, I'll leave that there if you want to screenshot it, if you want to join in and, um, yeah, follow along with the template. Um, you just have to use that template or, like, the layout, and then you just use your own papers, anything else of your stamps, everything like that. But this was mine that I was starting off with. I got a piece of card and I thought about using this paper because it's out of a set that I got and I wanted to distress it because I really wanted to make like a man's card because I don't make much male cards um, and obviously to challenge myself I did try and scrunch it up here I don't really like how it looks but I'm just having a try I love this uh, leaf pattern here and then within the paper and I've just stressed all around and went round with my uh, black ink um, so yeah and then I've got a white piece of card and I've started to uh, just go around the edge with my ink pad just like that to give it a, a bit of more of effect because um, I'm not really the best at making male cards and I know um, other crafters say they find it hard so I just thought to try and have a go I'm always making like girly, Disney or pastely like, and then like purpley cards because purple is my favourite colour so I'm drawn to that it's a bit smudged there but that should be alright so I was thinking to put that on like that and then I have these toppers what was part of the set and some of them have fell out I didn't know if to use some of them I was thinking about maybe the clocks but I don't want to use that sentiment one because I want to stamp a sentiment up here part of the template so I'm not sure and then I've got the little black cutouts because I thought the black would go with all the black ink for these bits here the strips and for my circle, I didn't know if to cut out a circle or do I just use this? No, I'm not, I don't, yeah, probably this one. 
for the scent, like for the piece there, or the stamp, I don't know. Um, but I do like this one. Like music, maybe I could do like a music one. didn't know if to not use this black strip and if I use the music one I could cut out some of this music paper to put down um, I don't know I like just cut a bit of the edge of the music paper This is why like, I don't like to, I always do my uh, cards off camera um, so I can have a play about myself and see. Um, I don't know, I'm going to come back, I'm going to have a think. So I thought about it and I'm going to um, stick down a bit of music paper with it and I am going to use this music one with a bit of the music paper. So what I was thinking was I'm just going to add on these extra little bits of music paper underneath what I've been like uh, kind of ripped up to make them look more shabby like a bit vintage and then I was thinking um, this black one and I've got two of these um, music bits because I haven't got enough long so I'm just going to pull it like that you won't see it underneath anyway with that on and then I've got a stamp what says for you up here I'm thinking something like that um, so I'm just going to stick that down need to get a bit more man's cards done. I have seen some um, papers that I was thinking to get for men's cards um, what I can have for family for birthdays and stuff because sometimes I just buy a card if it's for a male where I'd like to make some more so that's like that and then we have to stick this one down I'm just going to put a bit of tape down I hope everyone's well I'm trying to catch up on videos um, I don't know what it is but um, normally when your videos give you like suggestions and say oh this video is up or something and you can see videos well my, on my YouTube I'm not getting that so I kind of have to go while I'm searching through to see what's been uploaded kind of of people's and then I can see videos and then I watch them and that um, I don't know why it's doing that whereas I used to have it always where it would come up in the digestions and then yeah just do this so I want that about maybe there and I'm 
just going to stick these ones down. Sorry if I'm going quiet, I'm just trying to focus on this. I do have a few other videos that I'm hoping to try and get up when I can. And I've got some free time. And um, I have a video that I want to put up. Uh, what sort of gives you a chance to win some goodies. So you'll have to keep a lookout for that. I'll explain that more on the video once I pull it up. What time are we on? Oh, it's, see that's what I'm on about. Been on for ages already. Right, that's down. Then let's stick this down. Do I want that? No. I've got to try and do it 3D, but I'm just going to leave it how it is. I just find it easy to peel off the tape like this really quickly when you... Normally I sit there using my scissors if I'm off camera and I'm doing it all carefully. So I've got that. So that's how it's looking so far. The music paper and everything. Should have stamped actually before sticking that down because is that going to fit? Yeah, should be alright. I'm just going to quickly do a little stamp and I think that's it. But yeah, feel free if you want to join in and use the template. I'll show it again in a minute. I just try to challenge myself a bit and do a mail card I'm going to put a bit more there you are so that says for you and that's it done so I hope you like this video and this uh card that I've made that's the template to follow and that's what I've made I thought I'd show after I made the uh, the base how I uh, stuck it down as a card and this was the easel card I was on about they're quite simple to make they're the easel square cards so you just use one piece of six by six card and then the other side you score it into the like this slot so you've got that part there and then you have this side you score this side well you fold it sorry to the uh, line here and then it makes this score line in between and that's what gives you that flap and that's where you stick down your base and then you have your easel card um, I've just put a bit of the paper here and some of the music paper and I think that's alright for a man's card and then you can write inside here or on the back so yeah thank you for watching I hope you like this video please give it a try um, if you want to take part with the template I'll just show it again that's the template if you want to screenshot it and uh, I'll speak to you soon bye